No more parties, full stop, Vicky. It's back to school to tackle a record problem. Now, we need distilled water. I've got triple, triple distilled vodka. OK, <laughs> can you clean it or drink it? Shut up. <laughs> The reason we use triple distilled vodka is because there's less impurities in it. So we're not going to leave debris behind on the grooves with this record. Right, equal parts. Start with the vodka and now the distilled water. In that goes as well. Now, we want a shaving brush. Now, you give me a record, my love. They play better when they're clean, you know. And all I do is shake any surplus. Yeah. And we go in a round circle. Round. My goodness, I... Oh, my Lord. Look at it. Yes. I mean, it, you actually, you can feel the, 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 the brush going into the groove. Yeah. And there's a slight cling to it. Yeah. It's rather strange the way it grabs. Now, watch. I'm going to use a non-static cloth. Okay. I'm going the way of the grain again. Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness me. Oh, to the Lord. <laughs> Oh, to the Lord. Now, look. Look at that, my love. See if I see it. Yeah, actually, you can. I don't recommend constantly cleaning them with the alcohol because alcohol dries. Mm -hmm. Some people send them out to a, to, to a cleaner, to a professional record cleaner. Now, I want to make sure it's totally dry. So I've got an old dish rack and I put anti-static cloths in there. No, no fluff. I'm, I'm very thrilled. <laughs> Are you going to do one? Absolutely. All right. Now, I'll tell you something that's got me curious. How big's your record collection? That's what worries me. I've got about 13,500 singles and coming up, must have been about 1,000 LPs. I've not been collecting CDs that long, so I've got maybe about 400 CDs. Well, so, I think you've done a jolly good job It's on not that. bad, is it? It's not bad. Not bad. You've only got 14,000 <laughs> What's that between friends? <laughs> <laughs>